So today I'm going to tell you my story and how I discovered network spinal analysis. I actually wanted to be a veterinarian my whole life and I was an equestrian growing up so I was riding horses and my first experience of chiropractic was witnessing a horse get a chiropractic adjustment. And it was just an amazing experience. The horse just totally melted when the chiropractor was working on him. And then when the horse was released, the horse just started running around. It was neighing, it was so happy, and it was just like magical. I was like, wow, this is cool. And I noticed whenever riding a horse after the adjustment, their gait would be smoother. So I thought, hmm, there's something cool about this. And I thought about going to chiropractic school to work on animals, but I didn't take it too seriously. I went to college and I was studying for veterinary school and I was working as a veterinary technician and I was getting all the ex experience that I needed and I was starting to realize this isn't really the profession I want to be in. The vets that I was working for, they were really low energy and it's not a very happy profession because a lot of times it involves euthanizing animals and so I was like really starting to reconsider. And then it was funny because I was working for a veterinarian who referred me to a chiropractor because my neck was feeling stiff. And so I went to a chiropractor and she was doing network spinal analysis. Her name is Dr. Lindsay James. She's now in New York City, so if you're there, you should uh, go check her out. She's amazing. And so I started going to her and she just like totally changed my life and opened my eyes to new possibilities. And so she basically said, you know, you should go to chiropractic school. And I thought, hmm, okay, I guess I could do that. And I was still thinking about doing the animal chiropractic thing. So I actually got into veterinary school and then I switched and I went to chiropractic school. And then I moved to Portland, Oregon for chiropractic college and pretty much lost sight of network and just was in school and learning more of the traditional chiropractic models and it's really like medical school and so it was just very intense um, schooling and I pretty much forgot about network spinal analysis and they only mentioned it a couple of times at the school. And so during my last year of chiropractic college, I was teaching yoga and one of my yoga students came up to me and said, you need to go shadow this chiropractor who does this really gentle technique. He just makes these light contacts along your spine and you feel really amazing and great. And so I thought, okay, I'll go check him out. So I went and shadowed this guy, Larry Novick, and he was an amazing soul and he opened my eyes to network spinal analysis and I realized, oh my gosh, this is the thing that got me into chiropractic uh, school. This was what inspired me. So I signed up to go to, chiropract um, go to the network seminars and learn this technique. And I decided this is what I was going to do. And so then I graduated chiropractic college and started doing network. And it's been an amazing journey for me and everyone who's been coming to the office. And it's amazing to help other people transform their lives. And in the process, I am transforming my life as well. And I have so much gratitude for how all of these things synchronized so that I was able to be a network practitioner.